I'm so glad to be here and to give you your Bibles. You know, I got a Bible when I was in third grade, and the dinosaur, no, I'm, not, I'm just kidding, but, um, but I am excited to be here and give you your Bibles, and I hope that they show a little wear and tear, right, all through the years, uh, because it's like, you know, when you go to school and you have a textbook, if you never read it, how much will you learn? Not much. So same with your Bible. If, it's, if it looks like this when you're 30 years old, it won't, have, it won't have helped you very much. So I hope you will set time, and maybe your family can set time every day to read a chapter and to learn from these Bibles. And we're going to say some special words now over them, okay? Receive the Word of God, learn its stories, and study its words. Its stories belong to us all. And these words speak to us all. They tell us who we are. They tell us that we belong to one another, for we are the people of God. If you'll join me now, we rejoice in this step in your journey with God. We pray God will guide you, your family, and us as you use this Holy Bible in your home, in your church school classes, and in our worship. We will learn together and grow in our love for God's Word. Thanks be to God. Okay, Maggie, receive this Bible and read it often, okay? There you go. Caleb, Caleb, there you go. Receive this Bible and read it often, and I'll shake your hand, okay? There you go. Piper, Piper, receive this Bible and read it often. Micah, Micah, receive this Bible and read it often. Naya, Naya, receive this Bible and read it often. Aiden, receive this Bible and read it often. Laura, receive this Bible and read it often. Last but not least, Catherine, receive this Bible 